of St. Martin. As Prime Minister of St. Martin, I take the time to commemorate Constitution Day, October 10th, 2022, marking 12 years since St. Martin attained its status as a constituent state within the Kingdom of the Netherlands. I also take this opportunity to celebrate the 10 pioneers, honorees, who have contributed their time and efforts to build the constitutional structure upon which the laws of St. Martin are founded and continue to govern this country until today. To those pioneers, I say, St. Martin is forever indebted to your contribution to her development. As we bid farewell to His Excellency, Governor of St. Martin, Dr. Anders Eugene B. Holliday, we remember his humility, poise, and integrity in the face of multiple disasters, both man-made and natural, including a worldwide pandemic. His tenure of leadership has been nothing short of phenomenal. Today, on Constitution Day 2022, we usher in a new era of leadership under His Excellency, incoming Governor of St. Martin, Meester in Rechten, Ajamu G. Bailey. Yet another son of the soil who, through his already established tenure of dedication to St. Martin, is ready to take up the mantle as the new head of state. As the guardians of this great nation, it is our duty as government, business, and civil society to uplift St. Martin and commit to her continuous progress and development. Over the past 12 years, St. Martin, throughout her infancy, has taken many hits in the form of governmental inconsistency, as well as natural and unseen disasters. However, there is no more time to dwell on what was and operate in a state of survival, but with vision and determination, take decisive action to make her what she can and deserves to be for the benefit of all her citizens and future generations. St. Martin, recognized as a small island developing state in the beginning of our constitutional maturity, yet with a strong foundation that has been set. We are on course to achieve our vision. As we embark on this new era of her development, we will continue to build until we can all see that we have given back even a fraction of the blessings that she has bestowed upon us. As your Prime Minister, and together with my Council of Ministers, I take the time to wish you, the people of St. Martin, a blessed, happy and safe Constitution Day 2022.